Friends, welcome to lecture number 17, that is integration of Cucumber tests with the Team City. In this lecture, you will learn how to push your IntelliJ project onto the GitHub, then set up the build on the Team City server to execute the tests, uh, your Cucumber tests, then how to uh, run your Cucumber tests on the Team City and generate the artifacts as well. Over here, I have got the IntelliJ open and then I have already created the Git repository. As you can see right now, I am on the master branch and we have got this mytests.java that is jnit uh, tests to run the cucumber tests. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to execute this test but not from here but on the team city server and for that uh, what you need to do is first of all after creating the git repository you need to push this repository to the github using this link share project on github and I have already pushed that particular project to github. So. You can see that uh, that particular project has been pushed over here at this particular URL and I'm just gonna copy that particular URL so I have already started the team city uh, server over here and uh, team city agent has also been started to create the team city project what you have to do is you have to go to the administration and then click on create project from URL and then you have to copy paste that particular github url of the project and then click on proceed and then next step it will open the build configuration so i have already created the build configuration for that selenium cucumber project as you can see over here and i'm just gonna explain you some of the steps over there so in there uh, when you create that uh, build configuration you will come to the general settings and in the general settings you can give the project name and in the uh, sample build you will have to uh, follow all these like mm, configure all these settings so in the general settings uh, you have to specify the artifact path as you can see that our project or the tests was creating the html report in this particular url so to generate the artifacts on the team city what you have to do is in the build, con uh, build configuration in the general settings configuration uh, over there you will find artifact uh, paths so just you have to paste that target slash my report slash star it means that everything inside that particular directory is our artifacts then save that then version control setting we have already given as you can see uh, this is the url of that github project and in the build step you have to select the maven because maven is the build management tool that we have used in our project over there you have to give the maven goal clean test to execute all tests but i want to execute only the test from that particular test class so you have to give the fully qualified name of that particular test class in this format dtest is equal to org.softpost.mytest and the rest of the things remain same and after that you have to uh, click on run to uh, run this particular build ensure that you have started the team city uh, build agent using the command prompt as you can see over here i have started the this agent uh, using the command prompt and then only we will, you will be able to see the like selenium executing the test on actual browser otherwise we will not see anything if you start that particular agent as a service or uh, if you run your yeah if you start your team city agent as the service then you will not be able to see anything happening on the screen so everything is configured over here and i'm gonna start the execution of these tests by clicking on the run now let us go to the home uh, page on the home page can see that build is running you can click on that link and then in the build log it will show all the steps that it is taking you can notice that uh, it is started uh, executing that maven goal and this test is gonna fail because uh, i have intentionally failed this test by giving in uh, incorrect title of the home page now it's executing the test using surefire plugin Now it is starting the Chrome driver. It will launch the actual browser over here. You can see that action happening in here on the screen. Since we have started the build agent using command prompt and not the service. So as you can see, it is gone to this website and then it will check the title. But uh, since the title we are given is wrong, it is going to fail. So as you can see the build has failed and you can also look at the artifacts by clicking on this tab and you will notice that this artifact has been created. 
you can open the index.html to open the actual report that was generated by the cucumber and as you can see the screenshot is also added in that report so that is how you can execute your cucumber tests on the team city so that ends our lecture number 17 that is integration of cucumber tests with the team city in this lecture we have seen how to create the project for the cucumber on the team city and then add all the settings generate the artifacts execute the tests and then view the reports as well i hope you enjoyed this lecture and stay tuned for more lectures on cellulam and cucumber